All right, hey guys, Fat Man's back, and um, today we're gonna be going over um my um New York Toy Fair 2020 want list day one. There's some that I want for day two, so I'll go over that. And um, oh God, help me. That's be like 30. I don't want. Oh my God, I, I will go broke. But pictures will be up on the screen. I think we should go over the comments first. What do you think? Comments? Yeah, I thought so. We have the um Exadora six inch. That is from Yu-Gi-Oh. It's a pretty cool one. I don't collect Yu-Gi-Oh. I do want to get the um Blue Eyes White Dragon, but I decided not to get that. I will be picking that up. A ten inch All Might. That's pretty cool. It's a new sculpt, which is cool. So that one could be a sell. That's probably gonna be. That's gonna do well. The Overhaul. Kuraga, I think. I have no clue. <gasps> then there's um the Shiroroki. Karanga's like the guy with the dust, the dust man, and, and there's that other guy with the hand over his face. That one's pretty cool. And then there's Sal and then there's Sally face <laughs> from the new video game coming out. I'm gonna cop that. I think I may pre-order that this weekend. I don't know. And there's Arthur and DW. DW. Do not why do not ask why I wanna pre-order those. I mean, when I was, um, little, yes, I was pretty obese, I weighed, like, 85 pounds, when I, no, I must have weighed, like, when I, when I was little, I was kind of fat, and, um, I'm still obese, I mean, if you can see, no one can see my neck at all, I said that out loud, didn't I, okay, I'll stop, um, then we have, I want the whole Soul set. I want the Soul 22, the Soul Joe, the Soul 22, Gwent Grinning, and Joe. Oh, I said Joel. It's just Soul. It's Soul Joe and Soul 22. There's one of Soul 22, Grinning, and then Joe, just normal. Then there's a Stan Lee, Thor, Ragnarok. Now, that's pretty cool. Those are all commons. Then for the exclusives, I want the Six Sense. Shinaranatoi, I don't know, is Devil Dog, is, is Demon Dog. That's exclusive to the GameStop, 6 inch. 6 inch or Bishkeek, I don't even know, exclusive to GameStop. That is another, um. What is it? Oh, it's another, um. Oh, sorry. Oh, must have. I think I lost my brain cells there for a second. Regain them back. Yeah, um. It's from, um. Yu-Gi-Oh! It's for all it's from Yu-Gi-Oh! Then we have the Endor Glow from My Hero Academia, which is exclusive to Amazon. I think I may have pre-ordered that already. It released on my birthday, so that's pretty dope. But then we have the um 10-inch Mewtwo. I'm gonna get that. It's pretty sick. I'll, I'll go with my 10-inch pops I have. Pretty hyped for that. Then we have the Skeleton Hulk, which is um oh the 10-inch Mew is shared with Target. Or is exclusive to Target. Then the Skeleton Hulk is exclusive to Walmart. I will get that. I'm going to try to pre-order that hopefully. Then we have the 10-inch Volpex. Again, the pretty cool one. But 10 inches, I cannot take it anymore. It's too much. I will end it all. 10-inch. No, actually, no, I won't. Please, please, no one report me for that. But yeah, just 10-inch pops are too much. It's insane. Then we have the Champa Flock from Dragon Ball Z, which is shared with Hot Topic and the 10-inch Full packs is also shared with um, Target. We have the Champa's Hot Topic. Then we have the the Surfer the Sky Dragon. That's super cool, which is exclusive to Hot Topic. Then we have the Sunyu Invisible, which is the girl from Dragon Ball Z, like a giant tongue. Um, that's exclusive to Hot Topic. Then we have the Kuban 10 inch. Um, that's a Pokemon Pop. Pretty cool. That's exclusive to Target. Then we have the King's Bugs Bunny, which is another one that's exclusive to Target. And there we have it, guys. That is my walk list. Um, we do have a lot that I cannot go over, that I cannot take, and it's too much. Funko, you're killing me. Literally. My soul, my kidneys are shutting down. They're failing.